we've got a real treat for everybody. And I thought, excuse me there. I thought we were done. I thought she learned her lesson. I thought her mom and that mean lady from Dance Moms gave Jojo Siwa a talking to, okay? What are we so doing? Essentially, what's going on now is uh, we have a new dance from Jojo. Do we have audio here? What's the audio sound like? <laughs> oh God, it's gonna, they're gonna freaking, they're gonna copyright us. They're gonna, let's just, let's just do it with no audio. We'll put our own audio in for this segment because we've got a new dance from Mrs. Siwa. And if this one isn't better and even awesomer than the last one, ah, go back. I don't know what is. So if you're tuning in now, get ready, grab a snack. We're going to learn this together. And... Make fun of um, um, Jojo Siwa. Uh, this dance, look at this dance from Jojo Siwa. This is her new dance, and I mean, we're the it's the it's 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 dare I say elephant like. I mean, oh yes, yes, yes. Oh my God! Look at this. It's. So here's the elephant. There it is. There it is. Oh, go back. Go. Can we go back? No, uh, we can't go back. Uh, the controls don't work. F you Facebook. Let's just watch it again. So here comes, let's analyze this. So the scooping is interesting. What we need to figure out here with Jojo Siwa is if she is in fact a better dancer than Ray Gun this uh, Olympic dancer from the Olympics. I'm not going to speak on Ray Gun this week for a variety of reasons. What are we doing? Because, listen, everyone is shitting on my girl, okay? She made it to the Olympics. What are we doing? And so the same way that everyone quickly switched up on the boxer, like remember when everyone was like, hey, why they let this person box this female in a little bit? And then once everyone actually read the article, Joe Rogan, everyone realized, oh, she's actually allowed to be there. Go you, you're winning, boo, do your thing. Win, girl, win. But when it comes to Ray Gun. The whole bit is, uh, no, she's canceled. Get her out. She's a scammer. She stacked the deck. She's the worst. She's the worst. She killed democracy. She's worse than Joe Biden. What are we doing? And it comes to killing democracy because she apparently had her boyfriend on the committee and her friends judge her there. Listen, if this was the best that they could do, this is the best. They sent her, and apparently, according to other podcasts, according to, you know, the church of what's happening now, this was an attack on the people who really worked hard to get to the Olympics to the point where we just need to do this person. They should strip Ray Gun. What are we doing? Of everything. And to that I say, hey, if your daughters can dance like that. Why aren't they in the Olympics? What are we doing? If you can do better, why weren't you in the Olympics? What are we doing? I'm gonna keep hitting this button until I get a genuine answer. For everyone who is hating on the Australian break dancer from Australia, so ooh, it's a scam, she scammed us all. She scammed us all, listen to me right now. It's the Olympics. It is a thousand year old organization. They are there for one thing and one thing only for all of you to make it go viral so they can continue paying people like Snoop Dogg $500,000 a day. What are we doing? Equaling a grand total of a $9 million contract for his time at the Olympics this year. We'll see you in 2028, Dr. Dre. We're headed to, con we're headed straight to LA. Let's go. And so, like, that's where we're at. So for anyone hating on Ray Gun, I will say it again. Why weren't 
you at the Olympics for what you're so good at. What are we doing? Go ahead. Put them up. Why weren't they there? And if you're saying, oh, a, I don't want Levi. I'm not a breakdown. Oh, I don't know how to breakdown. I don't know anything. But other people did. Why weren't they there? What are we doing? So we need to figure out who's a better dancer, Jojo Siwa or Ray Gunn. So let's say the jump, this. Oh, this. Oh, the look at my titties, move, like shake them, girl. And you know when she's on stage in her leotard, it's going to be even more exaggerated. Let's keep going. It's our guilty pleasure, the prayer and the step. Thank God, Jesus. Yes, sir. And the, oh, the break dance, the cha-cha, the salsa, the step, the step, the side. Oh, the mime. We love it, girl. Keep going. Keep going. Do it. Hit it. Yup. Yup. Hit it. Yup. And then the elephant. <sighs> do we, do we approve of this? I don't know. What's better? The ray gun kangaroo, huh? What are we doing? Or the Jojo Siwa elephant. We need answers. Let's find out. We're going to ask the audience. FDGB man, I need you to comment if you're still watching. Hopefully he subscribed after his segment in the beginning of the episode. We need to know what we think about Jojo Siwa and the elephant versus Ray Gun and the kangaroo hop because I'm pretty sure they're similar. If Jake Paul is allowed to go to the LA Olympics in 2028 for boxing. Jojo Siwa should definitely be there. Now they're not doing break dancing. Maybe they'll do regular dancing. I don't know, but everyone's blaming Raygun even though the decision was made before she competed. What are we doing? Get your facts straight, folks. So the elephant, I'm sorry, I keep going back to Raygun. It's all about Jojo Siwa. Back to her. Just the elephant. Oh God, she loves it. And, like, it's probably just a metaphor for, like, the dick she wished she had. We love the JoJo. She stopped by Access Hollywood to show her latest dance that just includes everything. We're just doing everything and anything. She says, hey, what's your favorite animal? You would, like, she's like a balloon artist. JoJo Siwa is the balloon artist of the dance world. What are we doing? Like, at this point in time, she is only doing this to make that mean lady from Dance Moms. Can we pull up the clip of Jojo Siwa getting yelled at on Dance Moms? Where's that at? Let's let's see. Her name is Abby. Abby. Abby kicks Jojo and Jess out of Pyramid what? Pyramid what? Where are we at? Kicks Jojo out of the pyramid. Oh my gosh. Let's get some sound going here. Listen to that. So at this point in her life, this is where Jojo C was at. And basically when she is doing this, when she's doing this, the elephant and the, and the dance and the goth and the makeup and all of the outlash now that she's an adult, the only reason for it is to prove this Abby woman was wrong. She is doing it because she knows Abby is watching and she hates that she is doing it. If you think that for one minute Abby approves of this, oh, you've got another What thing. are we doing? Abby is livid. Watch that. Look how, look at how she was treated by this woman. Next we have Jojo. Jojo, here we go. You were fifth in the competition. Oh, already off the bat, pissed. Look at this face. What are we doing? She's not happy. Jojo, from the beginning, at uh, the age of three, has always been number one. And now she's fifth in the competition. I mean, it's a situation where, look at this reveal. Uh, next we have Jojo. Jojo. Uh, oh, the look, her mom. Oh, her mom. Look at her mom. Jojo. Uh, Disappointed. 
pissed. She knows what's coming by the mom. Oh, the mom. You were fifth in the competition. Ah. You're fifth on the pyramid. Sometimes you act like a five-year-old. Maybe five is your lucky number or not so lucky number. She did a good job last week. Here we go. This is it. What are we doing? Mom steps in. Oh, the moms step in and look at all the other moms. Oh, look at each one of them. Each one of them has the same face on. When a mom steps up to Abby, it's almost a suicidal sacrifice of you and your daughter's position on the team and her future career as a professional dancer. These moms are look at looking down, looking down, looking off to the side. They want nothing to do with what JoJo's mom is about to say. What are we doing? It's, it's get it's oh, it's gonna get heated when she steps up. Oh, she did a good job last week, but look at these moms like holy shit bitch what are you about to say don't say anything right now just shut the fuck what are you about to say oh the look of the devil look at her look at that oh she this woman has protected jojo since the beginning and she will continue and she will always do so oh, the moms fighting with abby let's see five is your lucky number or not so uh. lucky number. she did a good job last week she did a solo, you poured blood on her, you put a four inch crown on her head. She did a good job. Keep telling her. She Keep did telling a good her. job. She did a good job. Keep telling, telling her. Get her, Jacqueline. You should have watched the movie. When you're given an assignment, you do it. When I'm in a hotel room and a scary movie, just. No, it's, we're not. JoJo Siwa. What are we doing? Is scared of the movie. She, she told her to watch a scary movie. She poured blood on this girl because of the movie. She's in a hotel room, a place she's not familiar with, and she's forcing them to watch scary movies. This is the issue. She's, oh, like when you're given an assignment, you do it. An assignment, you do it. When I'm in a hotel room and a scary movie, just. No, we're not gonna do it. I'm not gonna have her be scared for the next six months because she watched the movie you wanted her to watch. Like, and what we movie? did the dance. We watched the trailer. I told her what it was about. You didn't change your emotion. You, were, you had one look on your face oh, the entire time. It was good. She was possessed. It was good. Well, if you're so good, you don't really need to be a part of the Abby Lee Dance Company. Oh. Not part of the Abby Lee. <gasps> I know this bitch is not about to rip the photo of her off the piano. What are we doing? Don't you dare. Don't you dare. And you don't really need to be a part of the Abby the Dance Company. All right. Are we done? Oh. Can you put her picture back up? She deserves to be on the pyramid. She was in the group dance. She deserves. She deserves nothing. <sighs> what are we doing? I would have punched this woman in the face and first of all who is she yelling at because the person she's arguing with is over here that's weird but also like hey i would have so yelling at me about my kid like that honey let's be a little less aggressive oh make her Don't cry have an attitude that you are entitled in this world you are not you deserve nothing else. You well, earn it. You can't stand here and cry. You know what? No, 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 no crying children. You know what? I changed my mind. What are we doing? I completely flipped. I just became an Abby fan. And you know what? This woman made Jojo Siwa. If it wasn't for her, we wouldn't have a Jojo Siwa to make fun of. Listen, she said, look, this is, this is exactly what I am telling you people. If you are complaining, if they are turning you down, if you have to take an extension cord from your neighbor's house to yours because you can't afford your electric bill in 2024, this is the advice you need to pay attention to. Not as harsh as this, but in the same nutshell, this is exactly what I have written down right here in pen, in ink, permanently written on this piece of paper. It says it right here, the same advice. You are not, you have to go out and get what is yours. You cannot wait on anyone else. You have to be your own boss and your own person in this world. And if you think you deserve to be on the pyramid, just know at any point in time, someone can take your photo and remove you from the pyramid, okay? 
And that's how life goes. And if you don't start realizing that, like Jojo Siwa did it, just six, how old is she? Six years old? Here, seven years old? Then you've got a long thing coming if you're older than that. And if you're way older... What are we doing? Is start start the realization time that changes need to be made because this is the advice. Listen to it again. She deserves to be on the pyramid. She was in the group dance. No. She deserves no nothing. Nothing. What are we doing? You have an attitude that you are entitled in this world. Go. You are not. Tell them. You deserve nothing else. You earn it. You can't stand here and cry. That's right. I will no, 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 no crying no. children. No. Nope. None. None. Well, if you yell at me, I'm gonna cry. Get oh, out. bitch. Go. Go. Get out. Go. Get her out. Go. Get what this are we doing? child out of here. My son couldn't, my, I'm not doing it, no way. I couldn't handle it. If you're too weak for the sauce, get out and leave. This is what created, this is what we can thank for Jojo Siwa. And if you're not on board with what they're doing, then, I mean, you got to get out. And that's what they did. And I think it really shows that when we see things like this, it is because of Abby. It's because of Abby. And it's honestly, I've changed my mind. I was going in with her as another person we cancel on this episode. What are we doing? That goes to show, folks, you can be uncanceled in this world. Ask Andrew Tate. Ask Jojo Siwa. Ask them all. Ask all. Ask Kanye West in his Cybertruck. Ask the Beebs. Ask everybody who's ever been canceled. Ask Chris D'Elia. Ask Brian Callen. Ask that whole empire that's failing over there. Listen, ask anyone who's been canceled. You can come back. It's not going to be the same, but you can come back. If, if, if you, if you put your heart into it, you can do the titty slap with the prayer hands and, and the Michael Jackson feet and the salsa dance and the elephant. Look at the elephant one more time. There it is. Just the flapping of the arm, wishing she had a penis. What are we doing? In my opinion, is, is in my opinion. I said, in my opinion, it's what it is. So that's, that's Jojo Siwa this week.